Welcome guys, it is F1 2019 time. I'm finally going, well, getting around to doing a proper video on this game. I've been playing it quite a bit, ra well, rather a lot lately again. Um, after probably a month or so of not playing, maybe even more. But uh, I'm driving a Red Bull here at, here at Silverstone. And um, yeah, I'm used to driving a Ferrari, which is in the wing mirrors, obviously. Um, that's my career mode car now at the minute. Um, I'm in season two because I've not really played much of the career, but I've played enough of it. But, uh, but anyway, we're here at Silverstone for five laps. I don't really know what else to say apart from let's get into it, to be fair. But yeah, let's go. Right, we're starting P4. I'm going to be putting it into Rich Mix. Five lights. There. Out and away we go here at Silverstone. Well, Alex Albon's on pole position. Lewis Hamilton is off to a good start again. He didn't quite get past our teammate this time into turn one. Can I get on the brakes ahead of Lewis and don't turn in on me this time, Lulu? He didn't. So we're out in second place. What can we do with our teammate Alexander Albon now? Come on. We're up to second from P4. That's uh, about as good start as I would have wanted. Probably would have wanted to take the lead off the start, but you know what I mean? But where's the fun in just leading from the front? You know, all the time when you I can't where you have to where you're not overtaking cars. Here we go. On the back of Alex Albon with the slipstream. Can we get him going into corpse? I'm gonna put it on medium so we don't need to So we don't need to run out of ERS. He's still there, Albon is. Oh, we've made contact with him. Is he gonna back out of that move? He is, yes he is, well he's had to because we made sure we were sticking out of Red Bull in that space. Now, here comes the hard part. Trying to defend from Alex Albon and Lewis is making it three wide down the hangar straight. Going for second he is. And I'm going to hold Lewis Hamilton off and still be in the lead even though Alex Albon has dropped down to third now. So from first to third for Albon. And from 4th to 1st for Verstappen. Sending it 3 wide down into that air pit, down into the hangar straight. Lewis is trying to make a move down at the first turn. Is he going to hold it? No, he's not, because I'm going to keep it around the outside. I could probably drive a bit quicker here, but I'm obviously, obviously I still need to get one of those, uh, one of them holders for my microphone to have it, well, it's not sat on my desk, to be perfectly honest, but, uh, but yeah, we lap two, and we're leading. That's well, we led the first lap, obviously, from a bit of challenge from his teammate and Lewis Hamilton. But there we go. We're off that corner. Well, we're pulling away slightly from Lewis Hamilton, who is obviously, as of recording this, a seven-time, no, six-time world champion. Sorry, not seven-time. I don't think I can take that flat as much as I would like to. Coming to Maggots and Beckett's, the first part of Maggots and Beckett's is one of my favourite sections. It's going to be difficult to hold him off with DRS down this next straight, so on the next lap anyway, if, if he's close enough. Okay, Lewis, what are you doing? He's still trying every which way to get past us, and Bottas has got around Alex Albon. So you know what I'm going to do, it's going to be at risk for over being overtaken by Lewis, but I'm going to run the ERS deployment a bit lower, oh okay, he just sort of backed well out of that one. So I'm going to try and save some deployment, or some ERS power for that hangar straight. Hopefully we can get, a, well stay around Lewis, I'll save a bit of fuel as well. I really need to probably make more videos on this if I'm this good as uh, Max Verstappen in a Red Bull. Although Red Bull are there or thereabouts. Well, I'm saving all this deployment and stuff, but Lewis isn't really over the back of me, even though effectively I should be slower. But then again, he's got, as his teammate for company, as I should change up to third uh, eighth gear because you don't want to blow your blow your engine in formula one 
Yeah, so Hamilton's going to be more of a threat from his teammate than he is from than I am from him. Okay, so Lewis Hamilton is about to lose second place in this Grand Prix, is he? As we run wide, we're trying to watch the fight behind us. Does this mean I... Okay, yeah, okay, Lewis has lost for uh, second place, so... Does this mean I can actually run no deployment and still stay ahead? I don't think I'll be, I'll be able to for much, you know, for long, but... If it's helping us save some deployment for later on... Because i got a feeling I might run out of power by the end of the race. As both Ferraris have now got past Alexander Albon. So I do apologise if um, if it's supposed to be, if you was hoping for an entertaining video, well, it's entertaining enough for a Verstappen fan, but I don't really know what to say because I'm, for some reason I'm actually pulling away, well, I was pulling away from the Mercedes, from both of them. Right, up to 8th gear through here, through Maggots and Beckett's. I'm finally getting this sector right again. There we go. And is Lewis going to be at threat from the Ferraris behind as well? No, he's not. He's actually trying to pass his teammate for second. But is, is that Leclerc? I think it might be Charles Leclerc that's trying to get up the well up into this fight to possibly take second, maybe even a race win if I bin it. Which I'm hoping I don't, because we're on the last lap of the race now. As Hamilton sets the fastest lap of the race, yeah. That's okay, he can take that as... Where's Bottas gone? He's, he's dropped down to fourth. Bottas has dropped to fourth, I don't know what happened there. But Leclerc's moved up to third. Hamilton's now in second and possibly going to challenge for the race lead because it is the last lap of the Grand Prix as well so here we go we've got a few well I, I would run high ah yes yeah, screw it it's a win or nothing it's a win or nothing we have to stay ahead of Lewis Hamilton we're probably going to be out of Deployment by the end of the lap, not just deployment uh, out of his ERS power anyway. But we're pulling away through there, that's not, that's good as we just set the fastest time through that sec, well fastest time through that sector. Can we steal the fastest lap away from the big man? A couple corners to go, it's almost certainly a victory as long as we don't bin it, which is more than possible for me. You see what I mean on the curb, but for the final turn, the fastest lap and a race win. Max Verstappen wins in Silverstone. Well, so do I, to be perfectly honest, but yes, we won at Silverstone. We beat Lewis Hamilton. Christian Horner seems happy in his low-res t-shirt. Oh, there we go, it's sorted itself out now. Um, but yeah, we've won the Grand Prix. Yeah, pretty much. As much as as much as I, I, I want to be trying and excited, but I'll be honest, I'm a bit thirsty. Need a drink and I need something to eat. To be fair, but but we won. That was it's not uh, that it wasn't an exciting race. I don't think maybe the first couple laps were, but we just started pulling away. There's Alexander Albon. I might have to do a video with him at some point, but um, yeah, there's the there's the podium guys. Verstappen, Hamilton and Bottas and Red Bull wins once again but for the first time for a long time at Silverstone there we have it there's the three winners well the three winning cars only one winner and two a second place and a third place but anyway that's been a video on F1 2019 guys let me know if you want to see more and I will see you in the next one